Hey, it's John of Chicago South SEO and Website Services. Today we are going to be talking about how to upload media files. Now media files are simply pictures, videos, MP3 files, things of that nature. Now right now what you see in front of you is what's called the WordPress dashboard and the media menu which is on the left sidebar is where we'll start the first thing we'll want to do is we'll want to click on media now when we click on media we have the option to come to the right slider here and select library or add new um, what I normally like to do is I simply like to just click on media and when I click on media what normally happens is that it brings me to the media library now as you look at the media library you can see we don't have any files but we're going to add a file and the way we do that is simply by clicking on the add new link we'll click on add new and that's going to bring us to the upload new media section now there are a couple of ways you can add files there's what's called the drop files here a drag and drop uh, method which would basically have you having two folders or two two folders open or a folder that your uh, pictures or media is located and you would simply just drag them to this area sometimes that can be difficult for people so the next method is what's called just a select file so you would just click on select files and that's going to bring you to either it's going to bring you to your library section depending on the type of operating system you're using or what computer you're using in this case I'm using Windows 7 and so it brings me to the library section but it also brings me in this case I've already clicked on the pictures area now you have the ability here to select just one picture at a time or multiple pictures we'll start by selecting just one picture we'll select this picture of penguins we'll click on open and you can see the the menu that or the, the screen that's showing the uh, status of the upload and as you can see we've uploaded our picture um, we can further edit that picture right here such as editing the title or adding what's called alternate text or alt text which is uh, which helps for people with disability also helps when the screen is painting or the website screen is painting to give someone an indication of exactly what the image is and it's also good for what's called SEO or search engine optimization you can also add a caption which would if you added the picture to the website or your web page it would have text that would appear appear below that you can put in the description and then down below here is what's called the file URL or in essence the website address or location of the picture so that someone could add it or you could add it to code if you were tweaking behind the scenes on your uh, your WordPress page um, and so when you were done you would basically click on save all changes and what you can see now is that you have one picture in your media library what I also want to do at this point is I want to show you how to also add multiple pictures let's say you had three or four pictures that you wanted to add at once the beautiful thing about WordPress uh, the the, uh, the media function is that it now allows you to add multiple pictures and you can simply just click on select files and you can select um, multiple files and on a Windows 7 machine you simply just you hold down the control key and you click and we'll bring in jellyfish and the Kahala and we'll click open and what's happening is that multiple pictures are being uploaded and you can see the progress bars here are showing you where each one is and unless the pictures are just huge are huge file sizes it goes it happens pretty quickly now one thing you notice is now that you've uploaded multiple pictures you don't have the option to edit right in the uh, upload new media section and what you will have to basically do is you will click on save changes this will bring you to the media library and you'll have to select each one of those pictures one by one for instance if I wanted to edit the Kohala I would simply just drop down here and click on edit I can also if I didn't if I made a mistake and I didn't want to upload this I can delete it permanently I can view it but we're gonna go ahead and click on edit so you can see that how that function works and that just brings you to the same screen we looked at earlier the uh, 
the, the media editing screen they're still in full for your title your alt text your caption your description and also the file URA URL sorry about that and the website address or website location for this image um, when you're done you simply click on update media so okay so that's how you upload a picture or multiple pictures and once you bring those pictures in that's how you also edit it now bear in mind I just want to mention that you can further edit the image and you can do things like resize it and you can crop it um, let's take a quick look real quick before we go just so you can see all that in action you would just simply click on edit image and that's going to give you the ability to make some changes to the picture such as, as I said earlier resizing it cropping it flipping it uh, uh, doing all sorts of things that's how you do that we're going to and when you're done you would click save we're going to cancel a lot of this because we didn't make any changes and we'll click on library and it'll bring us back to the media library okay so that's how you make various changes to pictures it's how you upload it um, hopefully this video has been helpful to you once again this is John from Chicago South SEO and website services just saying to you take care and have a great day